It's the low carb keto paleo version of what everyone else is eating. And for the price of one meal, you can make a few more with this recipe. So the first thing we want to do is start by making our salsa chicken recipe. It goes without saying that you can substitute the chicken with steak, grilled shrimp, or whatever protein you have around. But this chicken, mm, oh man, perfectly juicy. You make it by placing the chicken breast and salsa inside the slow cooker. You give it a quick mix and close the lid. Then set it to five to six hours on high, depending on how much chicken you put in there, and that's it. For a budget-friendly option, swap out the chicken breast for boneless, skinless thighs. Those work great too. When you take it out, it's perfectly cooked and super easy to shred between two forks or slice it up, however you love to cook up your chicken. So in my large pan, I'm going to heat up some cauliflower rice. I saved some time and bought the cauliflower already rice, but if you wanna learn how to do that, I'll link a how-to post right below this video. Cauliflower has a similar texture to rice and easily adapts to the flavors of your recipe, therefore making it a terrific substitute for rice in a burrito bowl. I'm gonna build a base of cauliflower rice in a bowl, top it with our incredible salsa chicken, top it with shredded cheese. Now, if you're strict paleo, you're sadly leaving it out. And then some salsa, black olives, guacamole or avocado, and sour cream. Take a look at this bowl of happiness. I'm going to dig in. Give me a second. Oh my, make sure to check the link in the description box for the printable recipe if you need it. And I mean, while you're down there, look left and click the subscribe button. A new awesome video comes out every single week. See you next time.